Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So the next important exam which you have is GATE 2025. And for GATE exam, it's not only important to just qualify the exam, but also to have a good rank. A good rank is going to decide that in which university or in which IIT or institute you are going to get your PhD admission in or if you can apply for a, a PSU for a job position or not. So a good rank is really important. And I'm here to talk about five of those important things which you can do in order to ensure a really good rank in GATE exam. And this I'm telling based upon interviews, based upon my experience of teaching for GATE exam, based upon in students which I have interacted and those who have ensured good rank in the pre previous GATE exams. So based upon their experiences, based upon my experience, I'm going to share some points with you. All right. So let's start with it. The first and the most important thing which you have to do in order to ensure good rank in GATE exam is to complete your syllabus. Okay. Now, although you are very near to the exam, this is already around uh, like starting or the mid of December, you can consider you just have one and a half month. But still, I believe that you have already pre started your preparation for GATE exam and you have already covered almost all of the syllabus of GATE exam. In case if you have not done that, please make sure that in next coming 15, 20 days, you are able to finish almost major part of your syllabus. Okay. Now, when we prepare for CSI net exam, the preparation is little different because there it's okay if you are preparing two part of it like organic, inorganic and physical chemistry. If you just do two of them and just touch the third one or just do a over overview of the third part, it's fine to qualify that exam. But in gate, it's not like that because here you do not have options in the questions. Okay, you have to do or you have to solve each and every question which you have in the paper. Okay. So keeping that in mind, you have to cover most of the syllabus. So to get good score, you have to solve a lot of questions in exam. And to make sure that you, you are able to solve more questions, you have to cover more syllabus of the exam. Okay. So if you have already covered two part of uh, syllabus, let's say organic and inorganic or uh, physical and inorganic chemistry, whatever part if you have done, you have to also do the third part of it. And for that, you can follow my video where I have discussed about most scoring topics of GATE exam, where I have analyzed previous years of GATE exams and I have made a video with a very good and detailed statistics where I have discussed that which topics are there which can give you good marks and which are there which are not that a high weightage. Okay, so follow that video to make sure that you are covering all the high weightage topics. All right. Now, the second important thing is aptitude part because when you sit for the exam apart from your uh, like uh, 85 marks for your su subject that is for chemistry you also get 15 marks aptitude and when you are targeting high score you cannot ignore 15 marks which you are getting for the aptitude part okay so for that sake you have to solve aptitude questions as well and for that you have to you don't you do not have to give a lot of effort for that you do not have to do something special for that the best thing which you can do is solve previous year's questions of aptitude part or you can just follow my series of videos where I have discussed about uh, gate aptitude series. So that is a very uh, like very well watched series and many people have got good uh, results after watching those series and they have got a lot of help in their exam. So you can also follow that particular series. All right. The third thing which you have to do and that is more important. Okay. It is practice. Now you have to practice more and more question. It's uh, it becomes really, really important that if you understand a concept, if you are, if you know a particular concept, you should also be able to solve question. See, these competitive exams comes in two part. Okay, it's not only just understanding the concept. There are people, there are many students I know, they are very good at a particular topic. They understand the concept really well, and if I ask them, they can explain it to me very well. But when it comes to the question, when the when it comes to a problem solving approach, there they lack. Okay, and when it is the same question, same topic asked in exam, they're not able to solve it because question solving and especially these MCQ type questions or the types of questions which come in gate exam, it requires a lot of analytical thinking and a lot of understanding. So first step is to understand the question, then to answer it correctly, then to solve it correctly and then to mark it correctly. Okay, So there are a lot of steps involved to solve a particular question. So that's why it becomes easy if you practice it while prepare, preparing for the exam. Now, there are different ways you can do it. Either you can just start solving questions. But what I will suggest you is to do previous year's questions. Okay, so to practice question, you can use previous year's questions. And especially if you are following uh, topic wise previous year's question, that will be best. So I have already launched a ebook for that sake. So you can follow that particular ebook in which we have 
topic wise questions you can just go through that ebook and you can start solving uh, questions based upon topic so the topic which you have prepared already go to that topic and solve the question so we have covered questions from gate 2000 to gate 2024 all the questions are covered in that particular ebook link will be there in the description of this video so you can go and watch that the fourth important thing is to make sure that you are used to the gate calculator now when you sit for the gate exam the interface of the exam uh, provides you a scientific calculator and it becomes very easy if you are able to use that calculator to its fullest okay especially for solving numericals especially for the physical chemistry of course so when you are used to using that particular calculator it becomes easy for you to do uh, numericals and you can even do multiple calculations in single steps i'll be making a detailed video on this because i have already made a video earlier we have discussed about how you can use that gate calculator but there i have uh, just use the calculator for its basics okay but i'll make a video where i'll show you how you can use the gate calculator to do multiple calculations in a single step how to use it for advanced type of question solving okay and do let me know in the comments if you want that video all right and the last and the most important thing is to start giving mock test start giving test series now uh, because as i said you have to get used to the interface of the gate exam especially if you have never given this exam earlier because when you sit for the exam it will be your first time and that time you should be aware that how the interface looks how you have to choose question where is the calculator everything you should be aware about okay and for that we have designed a test series which is very close to the gate uh, like interface and that particular test series is already on our website and also on our app you can give this test on your laptop or on your mobile phone this test series it contains all the new questions so it is not including all the previous years questions but includes all the new questions and it also has that gate calculator in it so that's the best way where you can uh, also give your mock test also give your test series and uh, along with that you also get used to the gate calculator uh, this test series also have video solution for the uh, for the questions so once you are finished with the test series or once you are finished with the particular mock test you can even watch your videos uh, watch the video solution to get to know where you have done mistake or where are the things required and we also have added some more questions into it which are topic wise mock test they are again going to help you to solve questions which are from the same topic and this is going to be a fully package which can make you uh, prepare for the exam like interface for the upcoming gate exam and we have also added previous years question ebook which is not printable in the app but yes you can see it on your laptop on or on your screen which contains all the previous years questions so uh, these are the major five things which you have to do uh, before uh, the gate exam comes and it's good to start as early as possible especially uh, the first three points which i have discussed that should be covered as early as possible and you can start giving your mock test from the mid of december to the starting of january because that's the high time where you have to give a lot of mock tests you have to prepare yourself for the exam so these were those five important things that can ensure your good gate rank and i believe if you will follow these points you will get a very good rank in the upcoming gate exam and i wish you all the best for it and i hope that this video was helpful for you do let me know in the comment section if you have any questions to discuss and all the important links are there in the description of this video also they will be in the first pinned comment so you can reach out to uh, that particular comment using those links uh, any other queries you can drop down in the comment section below and i'll try to answer you over there itself so that's all from my side for this particular video see you guys in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care